No, because we're doing documentary, we're going to ask you a few questions. About what? About what's your nationality? What? Your nationality. What's my nationality? Yeah. Black, African American? Okay. Do you believe you in the Bible? Here and there. Here and there. Well, the reason why I asked your nationality is because you can't find African American in the Bible. What'd you find in the Bible? Because I heard that before, too. Just got my job told me that. Well, according to the Bible, that we are the real Jews. And we are the Israelites. Mm -hmm. and we can show you that too. We can show you that you are a real Jew in the Bible. You got about five minutes? I'm going to show you a few scriptures. No, because I got a girlfriend that's an Israelite. She get on my damn nerves with all that. We be back and forth all day long. Yeah. Trying to get me to go to D.C. to yeah. some place. We go back and forth all day. I ain't talked to him four days. Mm -hmm. We just back and forth about it. So I ain't even going. But you know, it's the truth though, you know. I mean, we can argue that and debate that all day long because okay. she and I did. Right. So, we, so, 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 what you believe in? We do. We debate that all day long, like she will say, um, the beginning of the year, so what she say, April, something like that. Springtime, but Spring, yeah, yeah. Like, but, but where do y'all get that from? Because she never explained to me where you get it from. Right. And we do the rhyme with sixteen to one. We're gonna show you. Do the rhyme with sixteen to one. Cause <coughs> understand. In order for things to be new, it has to have life. Right? Sure. So we look at winter. Mm -hmm. Winter is the day, it's the, it's the, it's the, new year is the day of the winter, right? So okay. everything is still dead, so it can't be new. Understand? Okay. And then New Year is in January at the man named Janus. Okay? okay. We look at the, um, the ancient coins. You have Janus, a two face, one face in the back, and one face in the floor represents uh, um, the end of the old and beginning of the new. So really, the New Year is a pagan version holiday. Right, so watch so it's, it's really is in that, in that, well, y'all believe it's really yeah, in Yeah, it's going to tell you. We're going to do Deuteronomy chapter 16, verse 1. Observe the month of a bed. It says what? Observe the month of a bed. So the Bible says to observe the month of a bed. You know what the word a bed means? What a bed It means the, um, what the ear of the corn. Because during that time, the corn and the crops and everything is coming back to life. So you know and keep the Passover unto the Lord thy God. Right, because Passover is celebrating the springtime. So the Passover is in the month of the bed, which is the first month of the year. Mm -hmm. So that's the fall around the springtime. So it can't be the winter. You see what I'm saying? It gotta be when things come back to life. The trees growing, the animals back out, the grass mm -hmm. growing, the flowers, everything is new again. That's why it's the new year. But like I said before, new year in this world is still the winter. It's still cold as hell, so it's not new. You see, you see what I'm saying? So it can't be a new year. She, she said, but she don't never explain it. Right. And I said explain it to you. Right, exactly. But she can never, so it's like, it must be like, she's learning it. Right, right. But not catching it just yet. Right, exactly. You know, that. so that's what I assume it is. And on top of that, right, drop that, give me the book of Daniel 725. Uh, so you gotta understand that when a certain type of people, Namely, the Europeans, when they came into power, they changed a lot of things. Mm -hmm. They changed a lot of times, a lot of laws, and the way the world works. So, I'm going to show you this real quick. Because they came in and started changing the whole cycle of life. Right? Look at Daniel chapter 7, verse 25. Uh -huh. And he shall speak great words against the Most High. So, that he is talking about the so called white man. That he shall speak great words against the Most High. You know? And shall wear out the saints of the Most High. They shall wear out the saints, which is us, because we are the saints, you know? And think to change times and laws. He did what? Think to change times and laws. And he shall think to change times and laws. Because ancient ancient nations understood the new year as the springtime. But they came and said, well, you know what, no. It's going to be the day of the winter time. Same thing on the day, or start with a new day. They say a new day starts at uh, midnight. But that's midnight. That makes no sense. A new day starts at the evening. When the sun going down, that's when the new day comes in. So what? Four o'clock? Four, maybe five ish. Around that time. Depending at, at the on evening. The season it is. At the evening, yeah. exactly. Yep. Around the evening. So we know. <coughs> and, he, and he shall think to change times and laws. Uh -huh. And they shall be given into his hands uh -huh. into a time and times and the dividing of time. Right, so that's what they did. They changed the time and they changed the laws. So really, we're thinking backwards and upside down. Because when they came into power, they changed everything. So then we believe the need is the women. But what you said, we think what? Times and laws. But you said we think thinking backwards. Right. But upside down. Yeah, backwards and upside down, that's right. Because mm -hmm. they, they told us that. Mm -hmm. They said, oh no, we ain't gonna do that no more. We're gonna do this. We're not gonna keep going no more. We're gonna do it like this. 
the same thing about the Sabbath. When is the first day of the week? Sunday. Sunday, right? Yeah. So what's the seventh day of the week? Saturday. Saturday, right? So according to that, that's the seventh day. Get that real quick. I'm gonna show you something. You know what's funny? 28. But learning in this society, they say that oh no, the Sabbath is on Sunday, on the first day of the week. That's the complete opposite. Read that. You're actually the chapter 20, verse 8. Remember the Sabbath day to keep it holy. Uh -huh. Six days shalt thou labor and do all thy work. Uh -huh. But the seventh day is the Sabbath of the Lord thy God. Which is Saturday. Yeah. So today uh -huh. is the Sabbath. But they okay. say, no, 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 we're going to make it Sunday. You know why? Why? Wow. Because during that time, during the time of the Roman Emperor Constantine, they were trying to uh, merge paganism and the Bible. So pagans, they're trying to convert pagans to celebrate Christianity and vice versa. So they changed the Sabbath from Saturday to Sunday so you could worship the sun. That's okay. why they changed it to Sunday to worship pagan Sunday. You see what I'm saying? So they changed times and laws. But the real seventh day is Saturday. <laughs> That's right. But yeah, because some people say the first day is Monday. Nope. Like Monday be the first day of the week. Right. Right. And so. They never show you where they get Monday from. So right. I always go to start with it Sunday. Right. So did she tell you you're an Israelite? Huh? Did she prove that, that you're an Israelite? No. She just. She told her to. She, told she would just always tell us for stuff like. Right. Y'all shit is. Y'all shit is. Like, won't you come? Won't y'all come? Won't y'all come? So what is it y'all be going to in DC? Well, we 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 in yeah, Baltimore. Uh -huh. So look, right? Chill out. Uh -huh. Oh yeah. Chill out. Chill out. So I'm gonna show you. Chill. Hey, up. Uh, chill. Come on, chill. No, oh, yo, not, not this week, bro. Not this week. We got focus. Let me do the number twenty eight verse fifteen. We're gonna show you. Cause how do we get to America? Uh, on the boat, right? Uh -huh. Exactly. But that's in the Bible, though. Okay. We're going to show you. Give me verse um, We can do Deuteronomy chapter 28, verse 68. Uh -huh. And the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again. That word Egypt means slavery or bondage. It's the Greek word. Okay. All right. You know, we'll prove it. Make it a tip. Let's prove it. Let's prove it. Uh, so we're going to prove it to you. <laughs> I'll prove everything to you. We got Exodus chapter 20, verse 2. So she told you we're going to spell on it so it can make sense to you. Okay. I am the Lord thy God, which have brought thee out of the land of Egypt, uh -huh. out of the house of bondage. Out of what? Out of the house of bondage. Out of the house of bondage. So another word for bondage is slavery. All right, so watch this. Go back. Book of Deuteronomy chapter 28, verse 68. And the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again. What's Egypt? Oh, you said it's a Greek word. A Greek word, which means slavery or captivity or bondage. Right, so we from the top. And the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again with ships. With what? With, with ships. ships. Read again. With, with ships. ships. Now you just said that the black man and black woman came over here on slave ships. And that's the only race of people that went to slavery on slave ships was us. That's in the Holy Bible. See that? Read on. By the way whereof I spake unto thee, uh -huh. thou shalt see it no more again. Uh -huh. And the there. Then. Jason, get the sun. Uh -huh. And there. Ye shall be sold unto your enemies. You were sold to who? Unto your enemies. You were sold to our enemies. That's why you see on these ancient pictures, these old pictures, it says what? To be sold. And you had the slave ships. And okay. that's, that's pure history. But we're showing that in the Bible, because the Bible's about us. Read on. <clears throat> For bond men mm -hmm. and bond women, mm -hmm. and no man shall buy you. Right, being sold off different plantations, Having yokes around our necks, our sons, our daughters taken from us, all these things in the Bible. So we're showing that we are the Israelites, because God was speaking to the Israelites. But do you know why this happened to us? Why? Give me verse 15. I'm going to show you why it happened to us. We can do Deuteronomy chapter 28, verse 15. Mm -hmm. But it shall come to pass, if thou wilt not hearken unto the voice of the Lord thy God, mm -hmm. to observe to do all his commandments mm -hmm. and his statutes, which I command thee this day, Mm -hmm. That all these curses, all these what, all, all these, these curses, curses mm -hmm. shall come upon thee and overtake thee. And that's what happened to us. That all these curses came upon us and overtaken us because we didn't keep God's commandments, and we're still not doing it. Damn. 
So verse 15 on down lists all the curses that happened to the Israelites. And we fit every single last one of those curses. Oh, yeah. Every one to a T. You can tell us it like this, it, to make it more, just to make it more sound, right? So you can really know it's us. Point to, point to any one of these pictures on here, and we can bring it to you out the Bible. All right, this one. First, uh, 41. This one right here? Yeah, yeah. what's going on? 42. Yeah. You remember chapter 28, verse 42. No. Hold on, what's he pointing to? The rape. Oh, I got that's 32. 32, it's not. <clears throat> Look at Deuteronomy chapter 28, verse 32. Thy sons and thy daughters shall be given unto another people, mm -hmm. and thine eyes shall look and fail with longing for them all the day long, mm -hmm. and there shall be no might in thine hand. Get mm -hmm. that one where it says, a man, you should take a white butt, and then a man shall lie yeah. with her. Get that one. 28, verse 30. Thou shalt betroth a wife, right. and another man shall lie with her. Mm -hmm. Thou shalt build a house, and thou shalt not dwell therein. Mm -hmm. Thou shalt plant a vineyard, and shalt not gather the grapes thereof. Right. Do another one. Let me have 41. Bring it up. 28 verse 41, Deuteronomy. Thou shalt beget sons and daughters, but thou shalt not enjoy them, mm. for they shall go into captivity. Mm. Point to Only our people went to that. What's the number? 32 again. That's the same, <laughs> same, same one. That's the same, same right one. Same one. No favor to the young or the old. Oh yep. yeah, 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 yeah. Get that, get that, yeah. You remind me chapter 28, uh, oh, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50. So 49, so 49. Okay, cool, yeah. cool. You remind me chapter 28, verse 49. Mm -hmm. The Lord shall fall mm -hmm. from the end of the earth as swift as the eagle flyeth. Right. A nation whose tongue thou shalt not understand. Right. A nation of fierce countenance, mm -hmm. which shall not regard the person of the old. No what? Nor should favor to the young. Mm. That's right. Elegant a bit. Point to a note. Right. Point to a note. Right. Point to a note. As swift as the right. eagle flyeth. Right. And they always exalt themselves as they should. What do you want to hear this? This in there too? Yeah. Zechariah 11 to 5. Yeah. Zechariah 11 to 5. So the Bible is black history. We've shown you our history in the Bible. We just talk, we've been taught the Bible wrong. We've been taught the white man, love the white man, God loves all people, right. we all one. That's stuff not in the Bible. Is it's, there, it's all it, lies. And then another thing about the Bible that they lie to you about is you gotta you gotta understand these curses are the curses that happen to the Jews. Mm -hmm. The real Jews. So the white man today, <laughs> right, the white man today is telling you that he the Jews. When did this happen to the white man? Mm. Right. You see what I'm saying? So you gotta like stop and just rethink everything sometimes. Mm -hmm. This is one of them times where you gotta stop and rethink everything. Yeah, that's what she was saying. Yeah, just like the times and the laws. Let me explain that. You gotta look at this too. All right, so this is Zechariah chapter 11, verse 5. Whose possessors slay them and hold themselves not guilty. Damn. Mm. Remember, they, this man, he didn't go to jail for that. He got straight off. It happened every time. Every time they shoot uh, us down, they get off. Trayvon Martin. Trayvon mm. Martin. Brown. Mike Brown. You know, Sandra, 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 Sandra Bland. Everybody, man. It's it's slavery, man. And now we all, we all in the frenzy and up in the uproar. We all mad. But then, being in, being in the uproar, that's something that people, you're supposed to get your power, that's what you vote for, your politicians. And that's what you're supposed to make your politicians do whatever it is they gotta do that the, the go to the next level to get these laws changed. And so right. these elite people can't but get the same. I got you. But you know that's also a sin we're supposed to be doing that, vote for other people that's not of our own. Hold that real quick. Give me the book of Deuteronomy 17 and 15. I'm gonna show you. That's why we continue to fail. We still looking for a nation who can't save us. So, so what you do when you vote for your own and your own working for the other? That's right. You put a vote for. So, them. so exactly. So that's something that that's hard to get people to understand. Like right. And then then change starts with them. You can march, march, march all you want. That this and that wrong. But if you're right. doing it to the wrong places and the wrong people, right. I agree. It's right. just going to it's just going to keep happening. Yeah. I agree. I agree. Read that real quick. 17 to 15. 17 to 15. Yeah. Okay, it's not Deuteronomy good. 17 to 15. All right, so this is Deuteronomy chapter 17, verse 15. It says, Thou shalt in any wise, thou shalt in any wise set him king over thee, whom the Lord thy God shall choose. Mm -hmm. One from among thy brethren mm -hmm. shall thou set king over thee. Mm -hmm. right. Thou mayest not set a stranger over thee, mm -hmm. which is not thy brother. You see mm -hmm. that? That's, that's <laughs> Listen, when you do that, that's literally a sin. It's a sin. Because <laughs> sin, according to the Bible, is when you 
break the laws. These are the laws, these are the laws in the scripture. Mm -hmm. Now, the one thing that I did want to say in terms of like setting over somebody to change the laws, mm -hmm. you got to understand this. Like I said, you got to stop and rethink everything. The Bible just explained that we would be into the slavery for not keeping the commandments. Mm -hmm. So setting somebody to try to change laws won't change nothing unless our nation starts keeping the commandments. Right. This is how we're going to change it. Right. Now, our whole nation won't start keeping the commandments. Mm -hmm. They don't even say that in the Bible. It said that if only a few of us is going to do that, and only a few of us is going to get uh, redeemed mm -hmm. from out of slavery. So if you want salvation, you want to get up out of this uh, situation, you got to come back to your God. Because that's your power. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, like, the sister, she was trying to break it down to you. She probably wasn't very experienced at, at this time. But we we bringing it straight out of the, out of this. Mm -hmm. You gotta you gotta remember another thing too. My bad. I, another thing that you gotta remember is look. Think about how old is this? Like everybody got this in their house. How many people break it down and show you the history? Nobody can show you because nobody really reads this. You see mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Right. So uh, you know you can have well, anything from us. If you well, people people. I'm not gonna say that because people can read it, not but understand. they it's the way you misinterpret. It, right. it can be misinterpreted. That's why in uh, Proverbs uh, 4 7, it tell you, uh, with all that getting, get understanding. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So you can read all day, but if you don't really understand what you read, then it'll, it'll never profit you anything. It's the book of Lamentations, chapter 4, verse 17. Right as for us, our eyes as yet failed for our vain help. Our what? Our vain help. Oh, so this is our vain help right there. We're trying to vote for different politicians and senates and uh, congressmen, you know? And now watching, we have watched for a nation that could not save us. Right. Mm. What? For a nation that could not save mm. us. We watched for a nation that could not save us. So the ancient Jews trying to, trying to integrate, trying to find a way to live peacefully in here, when God says to come out of that, to come back to who we are. That's what it means to be holy. That's what it means to be holy. Because this is the outcome of wanting to be like other people. Come. In their ways and bringing the commandments. You see that? And voting hasn't worked yet. Have so, so, Devil. And it's you not know, going to. I think it needs, I think it's, I, I, I do believe a lot of, I do know a lot of us. Yeah. Especially when it comes from, uh, kind of back as far as whites. But then when you look at that, look how black people killing each other by the boatload of death. Bring that out. Bring it out. Don't bring nobody, that out. like. You gonna bring that out. They get that one out. All time reader. Look. <laughs> <laughs> Deuteronomy yeah. chapter twenty eight verse fifty four. Yeah. Never right. curse. Never curse. So that the man that is tender among you and very delicate. What that mean? What soft, sensitive, right. compassion, right. compassion, love, mercy, uh -huh. right? So the man, the brothers that once had that mercy, and compassion, right? His eye shall be evil toward his brother. Is that what? His, his eye shall, shall be, be evil, evil toward, toward his brother. brother. Just said it. That's the black on black crime. Black black keep on, keep on, keep on. Keep on. We hate yeah. each other, right? It's, it's more on that. It's we're more on that. It, but hold on. It's, it's more on that, but we're going to you know, understand how we hate each other because of the curse. You know what I'm saying? Walk down the street, somebody got to die. Every, every day in Baltimore, somebody is dying, getting shot. Damn. Damn. And it's sad. So it's like, where the, where's the outpour in the crowd for black on black crime? People, kids be up their butts. Right. When a white person or a white officer shoot and kill a black person, That's but right. it's like it's saying we can we can kill each other. Right. Y'all just can't kill us. Right, exactly. So at what point do you look for or try to get resolution? We start yeah, keeping the stuff. commandments. Right, man. Keep the laws together. Give me, give me just one eight. Like, <laughs> we curse right now. Yeah, we curse right now. Like, nothing is going to work. Nothing wrong. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's not like somebody playing with a voodoo dog chop or something on you. God cursed us. Yeah. He made 18 different nations and he cursed us. Because we're the only ones he chose and we don't even obey him. Right. That's the reason why. Right. See, we want every other way out but keeping his commandments. Mm. There's no other way. There's no other way. You gotta come back to this and keep the law. Right. But let me. Yeah, 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 of course. Yeah, finish. Oh, right, right. right, right. So it says, his eye shall be evil toward his brother, and toward the wife of his bosom, his woman, and toward the remnant of his children, which he shall leave. He's gonna stay and raise. Which which he he shall leave. Leave. Uh, he's gonna help and, 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 and raise him up. Which he, he shall leave. leave. Which he shall leave. Now we're the only rest of people that have men known for leaving the children. Mm. And single mother homes gotta stay and raise three or four or five kids by herself. The yeah. only brother out here who knows his father and has his father's life is him right there. All of us was raised without a father. 
A broken family no, home, no structure. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Chaos. It's like, it's like, right. It's all chaos. You won't have no order. Well, like you said, because the curses. Wow. Now, the only solution is this. This is the book of Joshua, chapter 1 and verse 8. <laughs> this book of the law shall not depart out of thy mouth. Read again. This book of the law shall, shall not depart out of thy mouth. But thou shalt meditate therein day and night, that thou mayest observe to do according to all that is written therein. Uh -huh. For then thou shalt make thy way prosperous. For what? For then mm. thou shalt make thy mm. way prosperous. Right? And then thou shalt have good success. That's when things going to change. Mm -hmm. That's when you're going to have success. Because what you got to understand is the commandments teach us how to love yourself. Yeah. They teach, us, they teach us how to be a nation. They teach us love and compassion and mercy. You understand? Mm -hmm. They teach us good rules to live by for wisdom and understanding. So we're not keeping the commandments. It's what? It's chaos. Mm. It's no order. It's disorderly. You see what I'm saying? So by us being a condition, we, we look for every other way for the commandments. Mm -hmm. But we was taught wrong. That's why. That's why we don't come to the Bible. We was taught like right? Jesus. God loves all. Just pray. And that's it. Well, how do y'all as it? try to change or try to recondition hold on, hold on. the way we as black people think. Hold on, sister. Now you said y'all is Israelites. Yeah. So you think being an Israelite is a religion? Um, yeah, I think they're religions. What so are, what so we just showed to you out of the Bible that Moses said this, these curses are going to happen to the Israelites. Mm -hmm. If they didn't keep his commandments. Mm -hmm. So the Israelites is not a religion because you're not going to find where we serve any religion in this Bible. In the okay. Bible. It's a nation of people. Mm -hmm. You understand what I'm saying? Because you can't tell me your, your nationality. You'll tell me that you're either black, which is a color that you're wearing, mm -hmm. or you're African American, mm -hmm. which is not a nationality. Mm -hmm. So, like I said again, like when we, when we say that when you, when you say Israelite, it's not a it's not a way of life. It's a nation of people. Con. You understand what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. You are an Israelite. Mm -hmm. You just don't know that. Mm -hmm. You understand what I'm saying? Due to what America has did to our people, mm -hmm. they defiled us, they destroyed us, mm -hmm. and they took everything from us. All right. So how y'all? How is it? How do how, we? How do? We. Yeah. Right. How? Man, Chinese ain't Chinese religion. <laughs> That's no. a people, right? The question no. is, right. is, 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 no. is African a religion? No. So no. Israelites not a religion. It's, it's a nation. Okay. It's a people. Right. Right. It's, a, it's, it's a race. Okay. It's a race. It's a race of people. Okay. Race. Right. There's no such thing as black, African, American. We Israelites. So, you are Israelites. You want to walk around. I mean, how are you going to try to get the message to people here to see the difference? It means so this curse can be broken. Good question. Before Good. all us dead and gone. In the blink of an eye, because we dropping like flies, like right. 20 a day, right. you know, in Chicago, 200 a weekend, mm. you know, and there's always black folks. So, if you, you're saying this, you're not a race, you're not a religion, what is it y'all want to do, and how you think you're going to get your word out to the people who feel as though they're God, because you feel as though you're trying to take somebody life. Right. right. You know. I so, what is, what you, what you, how you plan to do it? Right, right here. Isaiah chapter 60, 61, verse 1. Isaiah 58 on. The Spirit of the Lord God is upon me, mm -hmm. because the Lord hath anointed me to preach good tidings unto the meek. Be what? To preach good tidings unto the meek. So, by us coming up and preaching to our people, showing them, look, brother, sister, you are Israelite. Mm -hmm. Come back to who you are. Come back to your culture. It's not the way. He hath sent me to bind up the brokenhearted. Because we are the broken hearted. Look how we're living. In the sure. ghettos, in the slums. We got no hope. We don't have no type of faith. We need an uplifting. But that uplifting comes from this. Like, listen, brother and sister, you are more than what, than what they taught you. You yeah, are a, exactly. prince, and I do a princess that. in the eyes of the Most High. You are his chosen people. So, with that understanding, that's going to make you like, oh, hold on, what's going on? I got to rethink things. I got I to come back. Because when I first learned, I'm like, yo, I'm the Israelite. I'm God's chosen. Ch to hell with this. I'm going with this now. You see what I'm saying? Read on. To proclaim liberty. To do what? To proclaim liberty. liberty. To proclaim spiritual liberty. Like, listen, we have the kingdom that's coming. Come back and repent and keep God's commandments because the kingdom of heaven is for you. This is about you all this time, but we never know that. So to proclaim liberty, read on. To the captives. To the, we are the captives. Slaves. We in oppression. We slaves right now. Still in the land of the that's right. Read on. Hmm. And the opening of the prison to them that are bound. Mm. Get locked up. Black. Black people. 
that hold what, up the most yeah, what you can't rate. what you can't look at it like you can't look at it like that either because because now you make it seem and sound like black people are targeting even if you are even if we are targeting you ain't got to bite that bait um, you can deal with that finish reading that mm. you can deal with that i got you to proclaim the acceptable year of the lord and the day of vengeance of our God to comfort all that mourn. That's right. Now give me the book of Psalms 83 and 1. Read that. Mm, that was it's on it. That was on it. Yeah, that was on it. That's, that's the one right there. That's the one. That's, that's, that's going to do it. If this mm -hmm. don't seal it, then I don't know what else will. Can we read it? It's the book of Isaiah chapter 58 verse 1. So still going on to what we're doing is to help our people, right? You know? Cry loud. Says what? Cry, Cry loud. we crying loud in the street corners. You know? Spare not. Lift up thy voice like a trumpet uh -huh. and show my people. Well, show that, our people. Show, show my, my people, people. Show my people the blacks, Hispanics, and the Native Americans, you know? Their transgression. Uh -huh. And the house of Jacob, their sins. That's what we do. Look, brother, sister, you gotta repent. Right. Come back to your God. Stop doing what you're doing. The ways we live in is evil. It's gonna lead to destruction. Come back to your God. You see what I'm saying? So now you said that we can't like hold ourselves as like being targeted. Things like that, what you were saying? Yeah, because you know. Like, that's all you need to hear is like, you know, they're always picking with us, they always, but my thing is, are you doing something to be picked? Can I ask you a question? Hold on, hold on, hold on, wait, that's good. Because that is true. We all been talking about it. It's going to tell you in the Bible. Mm -hmm. Read that. We can Psalm chapter 80, 83 verse 1. Mm -hmm. Keep not thou silence, O God. Mm -hmm. Hold not thy peace, and be not still, O God, for lo. Thy enemies. Thy what? Thy, thy enemies. enemies. All these other nations that hate us, they are our enemies. You know? Okay. Make it tumult. You know what tumult means? No. It means the uprise, the up, right? Okay. You know? And they that hate thee have lifted up their head. Uh -huh. They have taken crafty counsel. They did what? They have, they have taken, taken crafty, crafty counsel. counsel. They did what? They have <laughs> taken crafty <laughs> counsel. They taken crafty counsel against thy people. Against what? Against, against thy, thy people. people. They plotted. They, they schemed. How you gonna get these niggas down? But what I'm, I'm gonna, saying is, okay, you can plot and you can skin. That's in the back with him. Hold on, hold on, real quick, real quick. I got okay, you. Go, go ahead. Finish that. I got you. And consulted against so thy right? hidden ones. Uh -huh. they, they have said, right? Come and let us cut them off from being a nation. They said what? Come and let They have said, Come and let us cut them off from being a nation. Is that not a target right there? That's not being targeted. Like it, but come on, come on. Come on. Hold on, let me finish. It can go two ways though. It can go two ways. <laughs> Alright, we got you, we got you, we got you. That the name of Israel. The name of who? The name of Israel. The name of who? The, the, the name, name of, of Israel, Israel. That these certain people, but what? The may be what? no more in remembrance. Let us cut these niggers off. <laughs> they have consulted together with one consent. With mm. what? With, with one, one consent. consent. That's why they had the United Nations table where they all sit around there. No they plotting the scheming and plotting and talking in the Israelites. I mean, you you know? can they are confederate against them. Uh, they are against <laughs> Confederate. No, no, hold on. I just, okay. want, I just want, to say, I want to say one thing. Yeah. We got to remember who the Israelites is. Mm -hmm. Those are the people that went into slavery on ships. Mm -hmm. Who went into slavery on ships? The Israelites. Us. Right, now you're so, talking so, so as a nation. So now you get it, now you understand. Yeah. Right, now you're talking as a nation. Exactly. Right. I get, I, I'm getting it gotcha. the way y'all putting it versus my cousin. But this is what I'm saying. I don't look at everything as being racist. I don't look at everybody as being racist. Okay. I look at, I look at everybody as individual that's how i look at it i don't look at if i see a white person he evil because of the past because i don't live in the past i try not to you know i'm not my ancestors and 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 and, and they shouldn't be, i shouldn't be held accountable they shouldn't be held accountable and responsible for their ancestors when it when it comes to when you see people like how you say they talking to us do i think do i know a lot of the stuff that they do is wrong and come about a lot of it. It is, but being a bus driver and I'm out here driving, I see us out here doing things and also provoking them as well. So it could go both ways. I got you. Real quick. It could go both ways. But the, the sad part to me is when nothing's done. You know, we get the book thrown at us full force, but they don't. But at what point? Does change come? How do you get to change to that point for totally what equal equality, equal you know rights? No, no, but it just don't seem like it's <laughs> sorry, my, my going bad, that way. I bet, I bet. 
So, okay. And true, my homeboy say that all the time. I have a homeboy at work, and he just read on everybody, everything, and he crossed everything, and he be like, you know, we're not equal. He's the same thing you just said. They're like, we're not equal. They, that's why we're not going to ever get treated. So watch this, right? I, I hear what you're saying, you know what I'm saying? Like, we all should be equal, stuff like that. We will see, like, white or black, right? Yeah, because I just don't look at it like... Right. But I watch mean, this. They probably do. So the question is, how do you God see everything? Mm. How do you God see everything? As one. As one? Get that. Sure? Get that. Get that. What you got? Get that. Hold on. And give me the number seven and six. I'm already on it. <laughs> so, so, so before I read this, I want to ask you this. According to God, is he the God of everybody or the God of his people? I think it's God of everybody. Hey, hey, in my yard, get, um, get the shot. Man. That's how I was always told. I think it's no, God that's, of that's everybody. Your, that's your, that's your, that's your Look at Joel, chapter 2, verse 27. Yo. And ye shall know that I am in the midst of Israel. Of who? In the midst so of Israel. Israel. What did God say in the midst of? Israel. Of Israel, you know? And that I am the Lord. Your God uh -huh. and none else. Wait a minute. What? <laughs> and none else. else. Hold up. Wait a minute. God says he's gonna what? And, and none. none. Your God and none else. God says I'm the Lord, your God, and none else. I've always else. been in the Bible. He ain't never seen you that. That's right. And my people shall never be ashamed. We're supposed to hate that thing. Because yeah, at the end that. of the day, why? Because God chose so us. Right. Read that. In the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 7, verse 6. For thou art an holy people unto the Lord thy God. Mm -hmm. The Lord thy God has chosen thee to be a special people unto himself. Mm -hmm. Above all people. Below all above, people. above all people. Oh, equal to. Above, above all, all people, people uh -huh. that are upon the face of the earth. That's what the most high God said. We ain't saying it. That's what God said. I didn't say it. We ain't saying it. You see, you know I ain't like saying? this. I ain't like that thing. You know, I just read it. <laughs> you, know, you know what I mean? So read that, you gotta be like, hold on, wait a minute. God said, what? Above you know what I mean? So at that point, it's like, wait a minute, something ain't right now. Yeah. We're starting to be equal, but well, God said, said we that we are above all people. So I'm not gonna follow what they say versus what, what God says. Okay, so again, mm -hmm. back to what I asked you before. Mm -hmm. Are you gonna go to everybody to see it and realize that come to grips with it, learn some things? What's, what's that do, you do, everybody, uh, do you actually go and talk to you? Give the talk where it's really everybody needed, but what you see is the most. You understand what I'm yeah. saying? But, so, what is y'all outcome on that so far? Like, how do y'all, do y'all, like, when you say a, a corner full of dudes? First thing, 846. Do y'all talk? Do y'all yeah. try to talk to them? Do some of them listen to y'all? We got, or yeah, do we, they? we come on the streets and talk. We got social media platforms. Mm -hmm. So we, we reaching the people, but we understand that all people are not going to get it. Because when when they get serious and deeper, that the most high only teaching a select few to that to actually wake up and understand and to come back. Mm -hmm. So every single soul not going to get it. No, they're not going to get it, mm -hmm. but you'll get a lot of They're going to hear it, but... They're not gonna. They're not gonna get it. So everyone's gonna have the chance to hear it. They're not gonna get it. Cause Christ said that what many are called before Joseph. Mm -hmm. So we out here for the one that's gonna really ask you wake up and repent and come back. But you know you gotta keep trying to. Of yeah. course. That's, that's that's the work right there. Just can't come at them today and then they don't see you. So years um, later you gotta like. <laughs> Y'all better not make me miss my bus. I gotta go get my bus. Yeah, that's the give, yeah, give me your card or something. Yeah, I got it. YouTube channel. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. YouTube? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, oh, I was gonna say no. Instagram. So, so far, do it make more sense now? Yeah, what you yeah. yeah, so maybe I'll listen to a song. Oh, uh, praises. Oh, uh, praises. We can give you another one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 do the thing. I'll see you guys. What you talking about? Send me to hell. Can I put it in now? Fuck you, too. Spirits, man. Spirits. John, the book of John, chapter 8. Hey, Duncan. You don't read that one, nobody. Get your little punk ass down here. What's wrong with you? 842. So what? So get down the street. Any questions? Any questions? If you want to combat it, you email. Alright, what's the number? Alright, 4-1-0. I gotta put your names in there, right? Yeah, Adriel. You can ask for that. <laughs> How you know? Who's what? Adriel. A D R I E L. I'd be like, hey, the, the Israelite guy that's trying to teach me some stuff. Oh, crazy. So, what's 
we got email, we got YouTube. You know what I'm saying? So we can meet up, talk about it, whatever. We be out decent too. So I feel like we can put it in the What's pronounced is artist of your house shop. Oh, I don't know that. I just type it. Right, right, right. Yeah, I'm not. I just type it. Email and then for YouTube, you got YouTube on the phone, right? I had this on the phone, bro. On the YouTube, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, the actual app. Yeah, the actual app. Yeah. Okay. Oh, you know, I thought y'all was gonna say like Instagram and Facebook. I'm like, I don't do that stuff. Right, right. Yeah, it's all good. That's us right there. Our YouTube, so you can drop comments, leave an okay. email, you can test us, call us anytime. We're here for our people. Okay. Yeah, it's the uh the book of John chapter eight verse thirty two. Appreciate it. Ye shall know the truth, and the truth yeah, shall make you free. free. That's a powerful <laughs> So you know the truth now, sister. That's a powerful. That's a powerful. No, because I still had some questions. I'll be calling y'all. Y'all yeah. better not turn your phones off. All right, sis. 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 You know what I'm saying? So that's the first and more wild walk ups. You know what I'm saying? Lord willing, we're gonna start doing this on the regular. We just woke up to our people and just ask them questions. Give them the word, man. Con. So, brother HL, shut up, mom. Shut up, Israel. Shut up, mom, Israel. Call him up! Call him up! You have my 